an improper fraction is when the numerator is larger or equal to the denominator. So for example, 7 over 5. So 7 is larger than 5. 11 over 8. 9 over 7. 15 over 11. 8 over 3. Or 17 over 17 and so on. These numbers are improper fractions because the top number is larger than the bottom number. So therefore, it's improper fraction. A proper fraction is when the numerator is smaller than the denominator or the top number is smaller than the bottom number, if you like. For example, 7 over 8. 7 is less than 8. So this is proper fraction. 5 over 11. 3 over 7. 9 over 17. Mixed numeral is a number that involves a whole number and a proper fraction. For example, 8 and 5, 7. 5 and 6 over 13. 2 and 3 over 13. 12 and 77 over 100 and so on. These are mixed numerals because it has a whole number and a proper fraction. So please remember that. Please stop the video and write down these numbers, which one are improper fractions, proper fractions, and mixed numerals. Two and three fifth, so it's mixed numerals. So we just write it down here. Two and three fifth. Nine eight, because it's a top number, is larger than the bottom. This is improper fraction. So I just write nine eight. Five and one six is mixed numerals. So I just write this down here. Five and one six. Eleven over 8, so 11 is bigger than 8, so the top number is bigger than the bottom one, so it's improper fractions, so 11 over 8. Now, 4 fifth, so the numerator is smaller than denominator, so which is 4 fifth. 9 10, so 9 is less than 10, so which is proper fractions, so it's 9 10. 6 and 7 over 15 is mixed numeral. So 6, 7 over 15. And 15 over 8. So 15 is larger than 8. So that is improper fractions. So I just write down here. So 15 over 8. Now, let's convert this mixed numeral into improper fractions. So first of all, so to do this, all we need to do is we go 5 times 2 and then we add 3. So I just write down here first. So I go the bottom here is still 5. This this 5 here, we write this down. And then we do 5 and time by 2. So 5 times 2. And then we add the numerator here. Just add 3. That's what you need to do. So now we just work this out. So 5 times 2 is 10. And then you add 3 is 13. So we write 13 over 5. 7 and 3 quarter. So now all we need to do, this 4 here, I just write this down first. So now 4 times 7 is 28, and I add this 3, so add 3 together, 28 at 3, 8 plus 3 is 1, carry 1, so it's 3, so 31 over 4. So 3 and 7 over 4. So first of all, the 7 here, I just write this down first, so now it's 7 times by 3. So 7 times 3 is 21. You add this 4, a plus 4 together with 21. So that's give me 5. The 2 are right down. 
So the answer is 25 over 7. Last one here. So 12 and 5 over 7. So first of all, I write the 7 down first. This 7 here, I just write this down. Then the next step is 12 times 7. So 12 times 7, if you don't know your 12 times table. So just go 7 times 2 is 14. Carry 1. 7 times 1 is 7. Add 1 is 8. And then do not forget to add this 5 on top. So you plus 5. I write it down here. So that give me 9, 8. So that's, you give me 89 over 7. Please stop the video and try this one yourself. 1 and 2 fifth is equal to, I write this 5 out first, and then go 1 times 5 is 5, plus 2 is 7. So 7 over 5. 3 and a half. So I just write this 2 down first, these 2 here, go down here. So now 2 times 2 times 3 is 6, and I add 1, it give me 7. So 7 over 2. 5 and 7, 8. So first of all, I write 8 down. So 8 times 5 is 40. So 40 plus 7 is 47. 5 and a quarter. So we just write 4 down first. So 4 times 5 is 20 plus 1 is equal to 21. So the answer is 21 over 4. You can also use calculator to check it. So let's say 1 and 2 fifth. So just shift fractions. So put 1 and 2 fifth. All I need to do is press equal. 7 over 5 is correct. So now next one, I go 3, I get out 1 over 2, 7 over 2, correct. Then next one is 5 and 7, 8, so I can press 5, 7, 8, and I press equal, 47 over 8. So last one, so 5, 1 over 4, equal, 21 over 4, so correct. Let's convert these improper fractions into mixed numerals. So 17 over 5. It's just like 17 divided by 5. So now, 17 divided by 5. So 5 times 3 is 15. So therefore, 17 divided by 5 is 3. Okay, remainder 2. Because 3 times 5 is 15. So remainder 2. So we just write 2 over whatever that number is, just write it down. So 17 over 5 is 3 and 2 fifth. 11 over 3. So how many lots of 3? Go to 11. So 3 times. So 3 times 3 is 9. So 9, 10, 11. So remainder 2. So 2 over 3. 57 over 7. So how many lots of seven go to? 57. So seven times eight is 56. So eight times seven is 56. And we have 57 here, so remainder one. So which is eight times. So remainder one. So one over, what about this number here? In this case is seven, which is write this down. That's all. 34 over nine. So how many lots of 9 go into 34? So we know that 9 times nine times 3 is 27, and 9 times 4 is 36. So therefore, it's 3 times, So which is 3. 34 minus 27, so 30 minus 27 is 3, and 4 is 7. So 7, the remainder is 7, over 9. Please stop the video and try this one yourself. 
So 7 over 2. So how many lots of 2 go into 7? So it's 3 times because 3 times 2 is 6. So 3 times. So remainder 1. So 1 over 2. 11 over 5. How many lots of 5 go into 11? So 5 go to 11 is 2 times because 2 times 5 is 10. So which is 2 times. So remainder 1. So 1 over 5. Now 12 over 7. So 7 times 2 is 14. So therefore the 7 go to 12 is only 1 time. So which is 1. And then the remainder is. So 12 minus 7 is 10 minus 7 is 3 at 2 is 5. So 5 over 7. Whatever that number is, just write it down. Remember that for me. 41 over 8. So 41 over 8. So you know that 8 tam times 5 is equal to 40. So which is 5 times. And then 5 times 8 is 40. So therefore, remainder is 1. So 1 over 8. So you can also use calculator to check as well. Let's say 7 over 2. So it goes 7 over 2 equal this. I press shift, SD, this is 3 and a half. So 11 over 5, I just go or I can do 11 over min divide, divide by 5 as well, which give me this. I go shift, SD. So 2 and 1 fifth. 12 over 7, I can write 12 divided by 7. Nothing wrong with that because 12 over 7 is 12 divided by 7. So I got shift SD because I don't want decimal. I, I want mixed numerals. So which is 1 and 5, 7. Last one. 41 divided by 8. So equal. Again, I want mixed numeral. I press shift SD. See, 5 and 1, 8. Thank you so much for watching.